Hey everybody, what's going on? I'm GamerChick, and I'd like to welcome you guys back to more of Story of Seasons! In the previous episode, we remodeled our farm a little bit, and it, apparently we have a new merchant arriving, which is amazing, because I had intended on looking up how to get the next merchant, and I forgot how to do it, so the fact that this is happening is really freaking cool. So let's see who the new merchant is. Um, good morning, we've got some really great news for you. Thanks to the tireless effort you and the other farmers have put in, we have another country interested in trading with us. Right, the merchant practically insisted on coming to meet you, so we brought them along. Mr. Kenneth, if you would come forward, please. Oh gosh. He's a true farmer. He's a cowboy. Howdy! My name's Kenneth from Wheat Country. He's a cowboy. I've been hearing all sorts of rumors about this town, so I reckoned it'd be a good idea for Wheat Country to trade here, too. It's a great pleasure to make your acquaintance. Oh, one thing. There's still a bunch of countries that don't come here to trade. But if you were to ship a whole lot of beautiful things, that'd make this look like a mighty fine town to do business in. That's just a little piece of advice from me. Here's to your future success. Okay, you can check your calendar to see which days Mr. Kenneth will be in town. Well then, if you would please excuse us. Sure. Another country here uh, came here to trade. I wonder what kind of things they brought. I can hardly wait to find out. Yeah, I'm sure it'll be interesting. It will certainly be interesting. Okay. So, uh, what day is today? The 4th of winter. The wheat country is here today. We should actually go check out and see what they sell. Uh, tomorrow is the next competition for us to participate in, and it's for the honeybee field? I think? I think it's for the honeybee field. Don't quote me on that, because it's been a couple days since I played, so I really don't remember. Okay, the wheat country has sent us a pretty little letter saying to come on down. Come on down! The price is right. Alright, let's go ahead and take care of our animals. And uh, then we'll do our daily routine and all that jazz. And then we will go see what Mr. Wheat Country sells. Should be interesting. I'd like to see what he sells. Hopefully he sells some new animals. I would really like to see some new animals. But I'm pretty sure you don't get a couple new animals until like year two. So I'm not sure how that is going to work in our favor or not. Get out of here. I just want your goods. Hello, cow. Hello, cow. Where's the other cow? Where'd you go? There you are. Alright, where is my brush? I'll brush all my animals till they're happy and clean. Happy and clean. Happy and clean animals. <clears throat> Alright, one more sheep. Thank you, sheepy. Alright, let's go ahead and give the cows some treats. I'd like to get their quality up as much as possible. And uh, we'll do the same for the sheep in just a moment as well. Elmo. I wish I could carry more than one treat at a time. Here you go, sheepy. And sheepy. Here you go. Thank you. You guys take forever to take care of. It drives me nuts. Alright, and then my favorite part is the chickens! I love the chickens! The chickens are so easy to care for and whatnot. Chicken, chicken, chickens! Chickens, chickens, chickens! Hello, chickens! More chicken! Chicken, chicken, chicken! And then, hello, bunny rabbit! Gotta make sure I remember to brush you every day. I'm pretty bad about that. Pretty bad about brushing my rabbit every day. Okay, you guys have food, so you guys are good to go. And I just gotta check on the crops that I still have down here. I don't think there's too many. Yeah, there's only like four little plots of land, so let's go ahead and water those real quick. And um, then we'll move on with our lives. So, and a couple episodes ago I had made a ring because I wanted to wear it. And I couldn't figure out how to put it on, so I sold it. And you guys were yelling at me because I sold it because I'm a big dummy. And I know I'm a big dummy, there's no the point. The point is it was like one of the best like items for 
uh, stamina regen, so I'm actually gonna make another one. <clears throat> Just gonna make another one, and this time I will make sure I wear it. Apparently all you have to do is put it in your closet, and then you should be able to equip it. So that is good to know. To be honest with you, I just assumed that, you know, if I had it in my inventory that I could equip it and whatnot, but I, I guess not. That's apparently not the case, unfortunately. So, uh, yeah. That's, that's what happened. Okay, we're gonna go about our daily routine. Our routine's gonna have to change up a bit because I do have a bunch of stuff planted in the tall crop field and whatnot, so we need to make sure we get over there early enough to water all those crops and fertilize them. It shouldn't be much of an issue considering like I don't have many if not any crops on my farm anymore. Um, I think for this area over here, Granny's area, I'm gonna plant like the trees and stuff. Um, the trees that we have the ability to plant. I'm thinking I want to plant those over here. Uh, maybe two or three more plots of grass and all that and whatnot. I mean, nothing too fancy. Most of the buildings, if not all the buildings, are going to be on our farmland. Just because I'm not sure if I can actually put buildings on this side of the farm. I mean, technically, the entire area is my farm now, right? Technically, I own both plots of land, but I don't know if it'll let me put buildings over here. I haven't tried. So, I mean, I think I'm gonna plant trees and stuff over here. Cause I don't, I don't know. And if later I find out I have the ability to put buildings and I'll just kind of flip flop everything. It's not that big of a deal. Um, I just want to have a game plan. Yeah, I want to have a game plan. Cause in all reality, there really isn't that much room on our side of the farm. So maybe later I'll try to put a building over there and see what it does. I, I really don't know. Okay, where's the fodder? Fodder, fodder, fodder! Here you go, bunny! Yay, happy bunny! Happy bunny rabbit! Okay, the tall crop field is this way, I think. I'm pretty sure this is where our field is. I have flax planted here, so it should be this. It's all pretty and good and yay and happy. Bunch of flax planted here. Should be good for us. Someone said that planting the flags here wouldn't increase its quality, but I'm pretty sure it's considered a tall crop. Is it? Yeah, it's considered a tall crop. So I don't know why it wouldn't, um, unless that's not how the public fields work. I mean, it was to my knowledge that, you know, if you planted that category of plants in the appropriate field, it would help increase its quality a little bit. So. I'm not exactly sure who is correct and who is incorrect there, but I planted them over here just because it was a tall crop field and the flax is a tall crop. Um, if it doesn't, oh well. I mean, at least they're not taking up space on my farm, so it's a win-win situation. I think it'll be alright. Okay, there is all of that taken care of. Didn't take too long. And uh, let's continue going around and around and around we go. Where it stops, no one knows. No one knows at all. Okay, and the next scene I have been told is uh, with Rager is on a Wednesday after 7 p.m. 7 p.m. Which is like, or maybe it's 7 a.m. I don't know, it has to be sunny. I'll double check on that, because they said p.m., but it might be a.m. And if that's the case, that's, uh, that's 17, right? 1700. 1700, I think, because noon is 12. 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, yeah, it would be 1700. I'll try both on the day, I guess, when it comes around. That'd be fine, too. Alright, we gotta get as much stuff as we possibly can. Fishy! I caught a fishy! Fishy, fishy, fishy! Another fishy for me! Alright, let's get out over here and see if there's anything that we can collect today. Oh, snowballs! Yay! Apparently, sometimes the snowballs have goodies in them. So, I don't know if they have any other use. Um, I was told to just kind of take them out of my inventory and throw them. I don't know if they have any other use, so I'm going to actually look into that before I waste them all. Because if they have another use, I might want to keep them. But uh, if they don't, I will I will throw the snowballs and see what 
is in sight of them. The bird hates me at this point because the bird does not like fodder and I don't have anything to actually feed it at this time. Uh, it's just gonna have to deal with it. <laughs> it's just gonna have to deal with it because I don't have anything to feed it. I haven't been growing anything that it likes like uh, grains and whatnot. So we'll worry about that later. Let's go ahead and feed our squid. There's already five inside. Woohoo! That is awesome. Five squid inside. Alright, we got more fishies. Uh, apparently that was the biggest one of that particular fish that I've ever caught before. And another fishy! A willow fishy! Let's see what we can catch on the other side of the bridge, shall we? Do, 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 do. Anything? Oh, there's one. What'd we catch? I caught a fishy! Very small fish. All these small fish. Like, are there no large fish during the winter time? I don't know. I found a bottle. I have a bunch of bottles. Or at least last time I checked, I had a ton of bottles. Had a ton, had a ton, had a ton. I did. Like, it was too many bottles. Okay. Let's go ahead and get out of the river and we'll go into town. I really want to see what the ch new trader is selling and I need to buy more fertilizer, I believe. So let's go do that. Maybe we can spend some money, uh, especially if he's selling like tools or animals and whatnot. So definitely want to see what he's got going on. And I want to see Rager. Uh, apparently when you start dating someone in the game and your stamina is low, they will give you food. I realized that the last time I talked to him and you guys mentioned it in some comments that they will give you food, like, on a daily basis, which is absolutely awesome and helpful, and it's, it's freaking, it's, it's beautiful. It's what it is. It's beautiful. It's a great concept. A free dish to help get your stamina up, because they're like, oh, you're tired. You need food. Yes, I need food. All right, let's see if there's any requests I can accept for this new country real quick. Uh, probably not. But I mean, I can I can check silk country, cabin country, yeah, none for wheat country yet. All right, but I am gonna go over here and see what what they got going on. Hey, buddy, howdy, partner. Oh boy, he actually says howdy. All right, let me see what kind of animals you're selling. No, I don't want to sell. No, 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 no. He doesn't sell animals, but he will take my animals. All right, let me buy some items. Uh, blueprint. Let me see what kind of blueprints you've got. He has barrels, hay bales, and a public faucet. He has some kind of pretty pathway. Um, a red barn, or red bed, that's not, that does not say barn, I can't. That says bed, B-E-D bed, okay. A black fireplace, that's pretty cool. Spice factory, a small cottage used for making spices. Huh, that sounds interesting. Oh, golden watering can, golden sickle, golden axe, and a golden hammer. Oh my goodness, we're getting the golden watering can, and we are getting the golden hammer or axe. Let's do the axe. Oh my goodness, and the hammer and the sickle, should I get both? I mean, eh, I'll leave the golden tool. Wait, I wasn't done, I wasn't done, I wasn't done. Darn it. No, I was done, okay. Let's see what else you got. Recipes? What kind of recipes do you have? Mashed potatoes, corn salad, corn pottage, gumbo, grilled pumpkin, roasted corn, fried egg. Oh, let's buy the fried egg. Um, cornbread, boiled corn, corn pasta, corn muffin, pancakes, almond cookie, ice cream, orange juice, ice mocha, ice... No, cafe mocha, iced cocoa, blueberry tea. Okay, he's got a lot of different things. Let's see what kind of patterns you have going on here. Spring, summer set six. Fall, winter set two. Accessory set four. Let's get the fall, winter set two. Yeah, and I'll get the accessory set four, just because I can. All right, let's see what kind of items you actually sell, because I am curious. He sells wheat seeds. Who who would have thought he would have sold wheat seeds? Softwood trees. Okay, um, these are actually trees that I can harvest for wood. That's cool. He sells flour, 
coffee packs and coins right now. But that is all he sells at this point in time. That is good to know. All right. Well, it was interesting to see what he sold. And I bought a couple things. Um, a couple things being, you know, a couple accessory packs and clothes packs. And we bought, oh, tool upgrades. And they're going to be so beautiful. These tool upgrades are going to be beautiful. They really are. They're going to be lovely. Golden. Oh, I'm so excited. Yay! All right, Rager, hi! Hi! Oh, he's not going to give me anything because he's on the clock working. Oh, fine, I see how you are. It's fine. I mean, I have, um... Where's seaweed? I have some seaweed for you. Here you go. I brought you seaweed. Hey, yeah, I know you like those. You're welcome. Okay. What else do I have to do? Oh, general store. We gotta buy, we gotta buy uh, fertilizer. Definitely gotta make sure we buy fertilizer. So let's go do that real quickly. And then we will go to the safari area and take care of everything in the safari. And then I'm not sure what I'm gonna do after that. We'll just have to see where we are. I have to see where we're at. Can I buy some fertilizer, please? I need fertilizer. 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 I will take them all, please. Thank you. So apparently someone said that um, tea leaves would be a good investment because uh, you don't have to water them. And... I don't know. Apparently they said it was like a really good investment because you don't have to water them. Um, it does take about a month to bear its first crop and the leaves grow back every four to five days. So I might consider growing the tea leaves at some point in time. It really just depends on if I get like the tea leaf, uh, you know, the, the spice field or the leaf field or I don't remember. There's one field that like uh, is based around the tea leaves or at least, you know, help the tea leaves grow or whatnot. So I might consider growing those. Especially if they don't have to be watered. So that means, you know, we don't have to waste stamina to actually harvest them and take care of them, which is awesome! Which is absolutely fantastic. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and find as many items as we can in the safari area. What is up with all these old coins? That's the third one I've pulled out. I don't know if it's like a winter specific item or what the deal is on that. Uh, we do have another contest that we need to participate in tomorrow. It's for the honeybee field, I'm pretty sure. So, again, I gotta make sure I have as many items as possible that I can shell. As many as possible. Ooh, ooh, gimme, gimme. Thank you. So, that's exciting. Hopefully I'll win this, this, uh, field. I'm hoping. Like, I got my fingers crossed. I'm not sure. I might not win because we did have another competition, like, two days ago in game and that's not really a lot of time to like reaccumulate all the stuff you've been saving so I mean it's still possible that I could win but it is unlikely but I'm gonna try I'm gonna try I've been pretty good about winning fields recently I've been really good about winning these fields so I think you know luck might be on my side you never know I really want this bug though because I can sell it thank you bug Luck might be on my side. Let's get our hammer out. I have the hammer! Boosh! 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 Oh boy, I need stamina. I need stamina! Ugh! No, it's okay. Just keep- Okay, you stop mining. That's all we get today? That's not a lot. It's okay, we're almost out of stamina anyways. We're gonna go ahead and return to our farm. And I think that might be it for the day. Might be it. Uh, in the next episode, when I get that ring, I'm gonna put it on! I will put that ring on. Mark my words, it will happen, I promise. It will freaking happen. All right, let's go ahead and go to the farm. Back home we go. Back home we go. Thank you, horsey. Okay, there's no longer any snow on the ground, which is just interesting. Um, seed maker, let's go into the sewing studio because I don't remember if I put any like flax in here. Oh, yes, it was all being dyed. Gold, yes, I forgot about that. Okay, let's put it in here. Uh, golden linen. Make it into linen. Thank you. I thought there was more in here, but I mean, I guess linen thread? 27? Yeah, go ahead and put all of those in there. 
There we are. And this is still working. Check status, how many more hours it's got. It's got three hours and 30 minutes left in game time. So like when we go to sleep and then wake back up, it'll be finished. So that's not so bad. Not so bad at all. All my animals should be fine. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and put away everything that I have collected for the day. Unfortunately, that is all the time we have for this episode, so if you guys would like to support me and if you guys would like to see more of Story of Seasons, be sure to show your support by leaving a like and a comment in the section below. And also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. In the next episode, as I've said a couple times, we will be participating in a public field challenge. We have to sell the most items in order to win the honeybee field. So, until then, I will see you guys very, very soon with more of Story of Seasons. Bye!